Shore Sports Zone's coverage of Rumson Fairhaven is brought to you by ServPro of Eatontown Long Branch. Chris Shampo and RFH looking for its first ever sectional title. The Bulldogs hosting Johnson in the Central Jersey Group 2 Finals. RFH had a 25-17 lead at the half, but Johnson surges in the third quarter. Brandon Hund with the lay-in. It's 34-32. We've got a two-point ball game. The Bulldogs close the quarter in the lead. Sophomore Ian O'Connor stepped up big. With Johnson guarding the perimeter, O'Connor has room to work in the paint. At the end of three, it's 36-35 Rumson Fairhaven. Early in the fourth, Rumson's calling card, big three-point shooting, and the Bulldogs picked a great time to get hot, starting with Teddy Sorless from the right corner for three, then the other side, senior Tyler Pearson. Bingo! Just like that, quick six points, it's 42-35. And with a championship on the line, every possession is critical. The youngster, Jackson McCarthy on the drive. The lead is seven at 44-37. Hun kept Johnson in the game. He had 19 points. This three-pointer makes it 48-45 with 2.04 to go. Rumson has had free throw woes at times this season, but when it mattered the most, the Bulldogs shine. O'Connor with seven points via the charity stripe. It's 51-47 with under a minute to go. After Johnson makes a three, Rumson with a two possession lead. Teddy Sorless goes for the knockout punch. Look at this pass to Tyler Pearson, and he slams it down. What a way to end the final moment. Pearson's dunk puts the game away, and as the final shot hits the rim, history is made at Rumson Fairhaven. Here comes the dog pound to celebrate. A great scene as Rumson Fairhaven celebrates its first sectional title. 57 to 51 is your final. Rumson Fairhaven wins the Central Jersey Group 2 Championship. The Bulldogs are now in the state semifinals and a Thursday matchup with Camden. In the midst of the bedlam on center court, we talk to the Bulldogs about what it means to make history. It means the world to me, it's crazy. I mean, this is exactly what our goal was at the beginning of the season. I mean, last year we lost in the semifinals. We all, we were hanging our heads. It was a feeling I hated. And now that we got this, it just erases all that bad feeling. It means the world for our team. You know, we worked all year for this. I mean, everyone slept on us, but we proved everybody wrong. That was our motto all year long. It was a great team. We don't have any superstars, but we work so well as a team and we love every single one of each other. We don't fight at all. It's awesome. Shem threw up the play. It was supposed to be for Teddy. I just, you know, showed a little receiver action, went deep, caught it, and I just, I just wanted that to happen so much. I just, it was a great play, a great throw by Teddy. It was just a great way to go off this court. I'm going to remember that forever. It just justified, like, a lot of hard work and belief that these kids put in for us. So uh, it's just, just awesome. First in the history of the school, and it couldn't happen to a nicer crew. No superstars. For more Jersey Shore sports, log on to shoresportzone.com.